By the late Cretaceous, there were an estimated 150 species of dinosaur roaming the planet, each one occupying its own specific niche and so suppressing the evolution of all other animals. There's no way around the fact that dinosaurs did a really good job of being dinosaurs. And at the time that they were here on this planet, they were the best adapted animals for what they were doing that ever existed. If these dinosaurs hadn't died out, there would be no evolutionary niche for their mammalian counterparts to exploit and fill. Or, put another way, it's likely that no land animal we are familiar with today would have ever existed. If dinosaurs were still alive today, things wouldn't seem all that different to us, except, of course, that we wouldn't have the modern animals that we're used to, giraffes and elephants and so on. They just wouldn't have evolved because dinosaurs would still be here. Instead of elephants, there'd be large plant-devouring sauropods. In place of lions on the plains of Africa would be tyrannosaurs. Hyenas and wildebeest would never have existed because velociraptors and triceratops would still be here. But it doesn't stop there. If we think about the animals that we've domesticated, dogs and cats and cattle and sheep, they wouldn't be around either. So fast forward to a world without mammals today and you'd notice some major differences. For a start, you can't milk a dinosaur, so dairy would definitely be off the menu. But in the same way as we've domesticated cows, if we were to assume the domestication of dinosaurs in their place, they might make up for the shortfall in other ways. I think if, if the dinosaurs were around today, that humans would be controlling them just like we do any other animal. We would have other ones that we could eat. I'm sure we'd be farming and, and ranching and the whole bit with these animals. There's every reason to expect, in the absence of mammals, that certain species of dinosaur would make perfect farming. The size of a large pig, Protoceratops, or its present-day descendant, would make an ideal multiple resource. I wouldn't mind farming Protoceratops myself. They are kind of the sheep of that time. They're a very easy animal to look after. They virtually farm themselves. As a resource, it's, it's a great animal. You know, you've got the eggs to start with, incredibly nutritious. You've got the meat, which is absolutely fantastic. And the hides are very, very versatile. I really welcome the idea, grizzly as it sounds, of trying Protoceratops meat. Uh, ostrich, quite lean, very tasty. Why not Protoceratops? But of course, meat not being to everyone's taste, no one would force you to eat dinosaur. Now, I wouldn't have eaten a dinosaur steak because I'm a vegetarian. So there's no way you'd try dinosaur? Dinosaurs would have been safe around me. 